bad news for the United States Air Force. An individual by the name of Monica Witt is said to have defected from the intelligence section of the Air Force to the Islamic Republic of Iran. Officials are saying that the information that she carries with her is extremely damaging to the United States government. Miss Witt defected to Iran nearly six years ago in 2013. She was a counterintelligence officer for the Air Force of Special Investigations. She has been charged with espionage along with four Iranian hackers. Prosecutors say they targeted former colleagues of Miss Witt in the intelligence community. The Iranians were acting on behalf of the government-linked Iranian Revolutionary Guard Corps. The unsealed indictment lays out the charge. Witt, who defected to Iran in 2013, is alleged to have assisted Iranian intelligence services in targeting her former fellow agents in the U.S. intelligence community. Witt is also alleged to have disclosed the code name and classified mission of a U.S. Department of Defense special access program. The important caveat here is that she defected six years ago, yet this is only being made public now. Now, U.S. Treasury Secretary Steve Mnuchin warned of retaliation against the Islamic Republic. He said the agency was taking action against malicious Iranian cyber actors and covert operations that have targeted Americans at home and overseas as a part of our ongoing efforts to counter Iran's regime cyber attacks. Treasury is sanctioning New Horizons organizations for its support of the IRGCQF. New Horizon hosts international conferences that have provided Iranian intelligence officers a platform to recruit and collect damaging information from attendees while propagating anti-Semitism and Holocaust denial. We are also sanctioning the Iran-based company that has attempted to install malware to compromise the computers of U.S. personnel. If this accusation is in fact true, it represents the greatest security leak by personnel within the U.S. government since the defection of Edward Snowden to the Russian government, carrying with it the alarming report that the NSA is spying on average ordinary Americans. Now this also comes at the same time that several unnamed sources spoke to the New York Times telling them of a decade-long plan to sabotage Iran's satellite and rocket industry. Jason Nunru, MRN, Niagara Falls. Thank you for watching. If you like this program, then please head over to my Patreon page and set up a monthly donation. It's your donations that keep this program running. Also, if you would like, please rate, comment, subscribe, and share in various social media.